Trenton, Ontario. You may have heard of it before. It's become quite popular over the last number of years. In this video, we're gonna talk about some of the top reasons why people are moving to this area. If you are considering moving to this area, please don't hesitate to reach out. My name is Jeremy Chambly, I'm a local realtor. My number is gonna be right there on the screen. My email down in the description. Don't hesitate, give me a call, send me an email, let's talk. And if you wanna learn more about this area, Belleville and the surrounding areas, uh, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you will be notified of all the future videos I'm gonna be doing showing this area. All right, let's get to it. Okay, point number one, and this one here is proximity to the GTA. Many people, of course, have uh, live in the GTA and it continues to expand there. They kind of look at the 401 corridor. You can go keep going all the way to Montreal. You can go up to Ottawa, but within an hour and a half from the GTA, that's where Trenton sits. And this is what makes it so desirable. You have many people that are moving here and commuting. Yeah, they're they're working in the Oshawa, Whitby, Ajax, Pickering area, and they will just jump on the 401 and commute there on a daily basis. And yeah, it's fantastic because it's so affordable, which will lead to our next point. Affordable housing. Yes, uh, when you compare to the entire GTA, um, Trenton is most definitely affordable. People look at this, they, they look uh, online at realtor.ca and they look at some of the housing and they're like, oh wow, look what you can get for your money there. And that has drawn a lot of people this way. Um, if you want an idea of where housing falls price-wise, and of course this is only specific to today when I'm recording this video in mid-2023, but you can get into the housing um, for the 500,000 range the new build housing. So we've got new communities that are being built up. You can get into those newer built homes in the high sixes, low seven range. And these are nice homes. And a lot of people are taking advantage of that, especially retirees. So bungalows are kind of the main build that's happening right now, single floor living, and it's affordable compared to everything you're gonna find in, uh, in, in Toronto area. And so that's why so many people are choosing this area specifically. Small town feel. That is a big reason why people are moving to this area. It's a smaller community in the sense that the population uh, is small. It continues to grow year over year, but the actual uh, city itself is between the 401 and the water, which is Bay of Quinty. And it doesn't take any more than about five minutes to get from the 401 down to the water. So really easy to get around. It has all the stores that most people would be looking for on a day daily basis. Uh, great grocery stores, many options. It's got uh, like the YMCA. It's got a lot of restaurants being built up along the 401. Uh, for those that can't live without it, it has Starbucks. Um, and then also, it has the Via Rail, which runs right through the city. And so that's something that people like to utilize as well. Um, but overall, if you need anything more than what Trenton has to offer in this smaller town, then you have quick access over to Belleville, 10, 15 minute drive, and you can get everything else you need at all the larger, uh, larger stores. So definitely a big uh, drawing factor of this area. Another reason, and this uh, this reason really has been drawing people to, to Trenton for quite some time, is that we have the largest Air Force Base uh, in all of Canada. So Canadian Forces Base Trenton is right within the city. You've got an airstrip. If you're driving down along Highway 2, uh, you will see planes all the time. Um, the locals will always say that. If someone's new, if you're coming for the first time, you may see some planes overhead um, and you'll actually look up, but you tend to know a local because they don't even look up anymore. Um, they're used to seeing them. Uh, military aircraft, big gray planes, very plain. Uh, they're, they're generally flying around doing their exercises. But of course, it employs a lot of people both on the military personnel side and the civilian personnel side. And uh, there's a lot of movement in the military. So a lot of people are moving in and out of this area for the military specifically. Um, it's been a great community, uh, military community specifically, and the military uh, has a really good tie with the community. People are really integrated between the two, and it's kind of definitely part of the identity of, of Trenton. 
Another reason why people uh, move to this area, they like that small community we had mentioned, but many small communities don't have a hospital. Trenton is that little bit larger, so it has its own hospital. And uh, recently they actually just did some work and they did some additions so that it can service this area. And so uh, specifically for people that are looking to retire, um, kind of to age in this area, that's an important factor. And so Trenton, it still meets, ticks all the boxes of the small community, but it gives them that security and that you have the hospital right within the city. Um, I've used it before, it's fantastic. And so that's one big reason that keeps Trenton uh, as an open option for many people. Another big important reason uh, as to why people love this area when they when they come through is that it is the Bay of Quinty that is right on. Uh, you'll see signs as you're driving towards the area of Bay of Quinty. And a lot of people don't really know uh, what that means, but that's the water. That's the area right down by the water that, that uh, the city's kind of built up along. And they've done a fantastic job in Trenton. So you go down there and you will see there's an area that has all the soccer fields, baseball fields, uh, the parks, all along the water. You've got the marina that's also right on the other side of, of the river. And they have all the festivals that happen down there. The fireworks happen down there. I mean, it really is a community hub. Uh, they've got the library right by the marina with a big glass windows overlooking the bay. Uh, it's quite beautiful and it's an area that has trails going all along it. And like I said, it's very easy access. You can go down there, you can park, it's free parking. Um, so that says a lot about the type of city that we are. And it's still from the downtown along the water, you can get to the stores, walk around, uh, just park and have a day. And so that's a big draw of this area that people thoroughly enjoy. And finally, um, the one reason why people are learning about Trenton is likely because of Prince Edward County, uh, or as the uh, locals will call it, Peck or the county. And uh, that area has become quite popular over the last number of years for tourism. Um, it's grown up quite a bit. Um, I am gonna do a separate video about the Prince Edward County area because it has exploded. But to get to the county, generally you drive around, you know, 401, and then you cut right down through Trenton to get to the county. And well, if you live here, you've got that access right away. And so while the beaches down in the county, um, the provincial sand, sandbanks, uh, you've got North Beach, Presque is another one that you can get to from Trenton, but they're busy on the weekends, but during the week, they're not too bad. And when you live here in Trenton, you can access those and take advantage of it. You can go to the wineries down in the county. Uh, all the other tourist attractions that are there are very easy access. You just drive down through Consecon and uh, you're right there. And so that's one reason why people have looked at that. Um, they've decided maybe they don't want to live in the county. Uh, let's, they'll live in Trenton because they're, uh, it's more accessible uh, to the 401, but then they can still enjoy everything that the county has to offer. So that's probably a big one as to why you will have heard of Trenton as you're driving through and why it continues to grow. So hopefully that has uh, given you a few ideas of why Trenton is starting to grow so much. If you do have any other questions after this, um, like I said, make sure to subscribe, hit that bell. Uh, I'm gonna continue to do some more videos talking about the different communities surrounding Belleville, as it did here with Trenton, with Prince Edward County, because uh, it's, I, I'd say the cat's out of the bag. It's been discovered, uh, but the housing hasn't gone crazy compared to what you see down in the GTA where the prices, it seems, always go up, no matter what's happening. Uh, whereas this area, it's still, it's, it's calmer still. And uh, you'll see that in the way that people are living, uh, the pace of life, and uh, I personally love the area. My family and I decided to move to Trenton um, because of everything we just said. And so reach out, I'd love to talk to you. My number's on the screen, my email's down below in the description. Let's chat.